Welcome to another edition of Tabletop Battle without Svein saying a single word because he has the baby call and we'll be introducing a new member. Some of you know him, most of you don't. This is the world famous We Roll t-shirt. Wait, this is Joachim. Yeah, it's me. He's uh, for some reason been a friend of mine for 15-16 years. I have no idea how we put out or put out. He's put out many times. I don't know how we keep what am I saying? I don't get why he's still my friend. He never he never wins against me. He hates me. Uh, I won a few times. Since when? Yeah, a few times. This is an ugly mug you already know. Uh, so today we and I'm now going to upload the sniper duel to YouTube, and then I'm going to go upstairs and leave leave these two tactical vacuums alone. <laughs> don't sue. <laughs> Tactical vacuums. How many wins do you have against me? Yeah, that's one. <laughs> yeah, one. Yeah, that's, win that's you? pretty much it. Uh -oh. So anyway, uh, what we'll be filming today is a scenario taking place closest to the Pacific. Uh, this will be the Japanese Imperial Force taking on the Aussies. Um, it's made by uh, Mr. Thomas Greenwood. Uh, and the battle or the scenario is Isurava, the Kokoda Trail, uh, August 27th and 28th of 1942, where you have a rather substantial Japanese force coming to take on the not yet decided green uh, <laughs> chocolate uh, soldiers of the Australian uh, Army, which will be supported by some regular and veteran units of the Australian Imperial Army. Fresh from North Africa. Fresh from North Africa. You can see the green colors dripping off, so some of them are back in their uh, khaki colors. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't even been able to replace their helmets. Uh, let's do the terrain uh, before we go to forces introduction. Uh, basically, all the debris that you see, that's the most important bit. All the debris, uh, be it small logs, big logs, or, well, anything else, on both sides are light cover. It's treated as rough ground. You cannot run, and if you run, it's six inches. Yeah. Uh, so you are allowed to charge with a run order. You're not here. But Shut up. You can you can charge six six <laughs> inches with a run order. Uh, so that'll be slightly stalling the Japanese advantage of well charging my ass, which they have have had uh, a little luck in the past with. It's fine. You're, um, you're, allowed, you're allowed to nod. I've been kicking. Yeah, 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 okay. Uh, the river, uh, he cannot cross the river without first being in base contact it, uh, with it at the beginning of his turn. This point, we will allow Joachim to run across uh, if he wants to, creating a nice bottleneck for me to shoot at. Um, the trees provide light cover if you stand uh, in them or well in them basically uh, this is a large forest this is the area of the actual forest and we'll be playing with the rule that if we're one inch in they can see out and he can see in that goes for this area this area this small area over here and that area and that area over there uh, so that's places where you can hide inside the forest. You know, of course, you can stand behind the trees elsewhere too. Uh, train, uh, taking line of sight, if I am here, there will be more than one inch to the uh, river. Uh, and Joachim will get light cover because I'm shooting from inside light cover, through light cover, and out of light cover. So pretty much every, sh every shooting action that you will see will include some kind of cover. Uh, the victory conditions. If Joachim can get his guys within 12 of my table edge, uh, 4 units, that's a draw. If you can get units also inside a building, it's a minor win. If you can get units inside 2 buildings, he's kicked my ass. That ain't gonna happen. Uh, and that's pretty much it, isn't it? Uh, there are a few optional rules. Uh, I could have kept the regulars and veterans in uh, reserve, uh, but I choose not to. Uh, Joachim could have kept one uh, fourth of his army in reserve. The units. 
three units, but he chooses not to, I think. Yeah. He wants to take me head on. So this will basically be simulating the battle after the Japanese have been repulsed by the rookies and received the reinforcements. Uh, and with that, we say goodbye to Mr. Sign and go to Forces Introduction. And I wish you luck. So, for the British, which will have the Tough as Boots National Characteristics... I will say you are not here, you're gone. Aussies. Go away. The Aussies will have the following. Uh, this is Captain. This is the first time we've ever fielded a Captain. Uh, he's inexperienced, but grants a substantial uh, morale bonus. Uh, we ha oh, he has a submachine gun. We have two times ten inexperienced units with a light machine gun. Uh, I will choose to... They will be green. I'll make them green. So when they take a casualty, uh, when they take a casualty, uh, they have to do a roll. On a one, they will take d6 pins and go down. On a 2, 3, and 4, they remain as they are. On a 5 and 6, they become regular and increase morale and, well, to hit modifier. Yeah. We have a medium machine gun team, which is regular. We have a sniper, which is a regular. Medium mortar, uh, that is inexperienced. And a light mortar, that is regular. Um, we have here two nine-man units of regular uh, infantry with light machine guns and one nine-man unit with uh, machine gun but is veteran, the only veteran unit I have. Uh, that's it for the British force. Uh, we'll be right back with the Japanese introduction and the patrons controlling unit thingy. And of course, Mr. Tim Chadwick Stevens chooses to be the cheesy captain. Well, I cannot understand the Chadwick, so you're gonna have to explain that to me, Tim. Uh, we have Farantis. Let's call him Sarge for this game. Uh, chooses to be the uh, medium machine gun. Then we have Repairing Act from Mr. Michael Fogelman. He was in our last public game. Yep. No, oh, no, that was the patron only game. Fogelman is back as a sniper wielding a um, anti tank rifle for the occasion as the sniper weapon since we're all out of snipers. And lastly on my side, Joe Medicine Crow. I think it Crow is taken from Game of Thrones. You're gonna have to uh, update us on that, Joe. Uh, the veteran uh, AIF team or unit, uh, and we'll be right back with the Japanese. All right, so we are ready with the Imperial Japanese Army, yes. where everything is regular. Yes. So first off, it's a first lieutenant with a rifle. Then there is a medic. Who uh, is controlled by? The Mrs. Doctor. The Doctor. The Doctor. First yeah. name, Yasint. And he's going to kick ass. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> he's going to at least save ass. <laughs> yeah. Then what do we have? Well, what, is, what is this? That is a sniper. Is that a sniper? It's a That's sniper. It's a sniper guy. Yep. <laughs> also regular. Yeah. Yep. Uh, then there's a light machine gun, right? <laughs> no. Pause. And kicking off with the Japanese, they are all regular so we don't have to get into that and first off it's the first lieutenant with a rifle yes sir then there is a medic and he is controlled by the doctor Jacint Oros yeah. and he will kick ass you're not here I know <laughs> then we got a sniper team yep then there's a medium uh, machine gun team yes and then there's the crowd crowd horde yep what do we got here First, there is uh, two units of 14 men infantry, infantry team. That'll be these guys and these guys. Inside that uni unit, you have a light machine gun uh, in both teams. Yep. Uh, and then you have uh, two teams of 12. Yep. Uh, with a uh, light machine gun in each team. Yep. 
then you have a medium uh, machine gun team, mm -hmm. and then you have the second uh, sniper team. Oh Christ! Two snipers. Two snipers. Yeah. yeah. Controlled by Mr. By Mike Golf. 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 And then the next one is shitty artillery. Yeah. No. No, it's good. No, what is it? It's a light howitzer. Yep. Type uh, something. Uh, type. 92? Yeah. Uh, basically the rules for it is instead of a D6 hits, it produces D3 hits when it hits. That's a lot of hits. If it hits. Yeah, it's not a lot of hits. Okay. Moving on. Yeah. It's a light, no, medium mortar. <laughs> Good boy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, a spotter. That would be this guy. That would be that guy. And then it's a uh, first lieutenant. I think. First lieutenant. Yep. Yeah. Uh, so oh. if you didn't get it, these are uh, reinforced platoons times two. And all regulars. Yes. Uh, so that'll sum up for a total of 13 order die for the Japanese Imperial Force and 10 order die for the Australian Force, which is taken from the British rule book. <laughs> now I said that slightly louder than usual because Sign has actually left the room and left me to my own evil devices. So I will now corrupt him. Yeah. And turn him into a spawn of Nurgle. But now he's not using his uh, old dice. Oh no, that's right. I promised in the last game that we played, I will use dice that don't belong to me. So good for me. So I don't know how this will end up. They might be stuck in Joachim's forehead by the end of the game, or they might be just turned into magical dice by the dice god. Yeah. We'll be right back after deployment with round number one. So we've uh, completed deployment. The Aussies taking up, well, for the most part, a defensive position. We have a uh, regular unit, or two regular units, hiding behind uh, the bush. We have the veterans hiding in the bush, along with the light mortar. Then we have uh, the green teams, yeah, green teams, hiding in the buildings, along with the Captain Superman, Tim, standing strategically behind the building, out of line of sight for everyone. So. Living up to expectations there, Tim. <laughs> uh, we have our, our uh, medium mortar over here, which is inexperienced. Uh, and our sniper team, which is Mr. Michael Fogelman. Oh, and of course the medium, no wait, the sniper team is Michael Fogelman. And the medium machine gun team is Farantis. Uh, you again has taken up uh, a blood curling charge, which is a British special rule, but he will be charting regardless. I will. Yeah, uh, you have uh, set up a line of run forward guys. This isn't the first time we've seen the Japs did this to me in our previous Pacific games with variable success. It worked in some scenarios and some it didn't. Difference here is he has uh, uh, quite a few uh, support pieces that can hurt me from long range. Uh, two medium machine guns, uh, tiny baby howitzer and a medium mortar in the back. Uh, so I'm expecting a little shooting, I'm expecting lots of running and charging, and I'm expecting a bloodbath right about here. Or along this line somehow. Yeah, the rivers, rivers will be colored red. Yes, the rivers will be colored red. Yeah. We'll be right back with the start of round number one. So only fitting, the Imperial Eagle yeah. Since we have the Imperial Australian Forces and the Imperial Japanese Forces. That's exactly why there's an Imperial Eagle on that. I got the first eye. Why am I holding the camera? You, I got the first eye. I don't know. You, you took the camera first, so... Amateur? Don't you know anything? No, you don't. Uh, I am going to place my units into ambush so that I can kill them when he comes forward. Which unit are you going to I'm going place into ambush? To my medium machine gun with uh, Sergeant Ferrantes in ambush. Ferrantes. That's yeah. my move. That's your move. That's my move. Yeah, and I got the next one. And uh, we've... Uh, he starts in a... Uh, well, the debris covered area. But we've allowed him to run out of the area instead of just running six. So pretty much he'll probably get to the river on the first move. Yeah. If he wants to run. So are you run. running or are you shooting? I am. I'm running. Yes, sir. And you are this running. This unit? That is a 14 man unit with no, a. 13. 13? 14. Oh, 14. 14 man unit with a. Um, light machine gun? That's correct. 
Now you see, this game is not only his baptism, but he's fresh into the ranks of bolt action, coming, well, just like me from 40k, we're still there, but uh, he's going to learn bolt action whether he likes it or not. Uh, he has taken a fancy to the German side of the game, especially his uh, in the mail now Jagd Tiger, which is eagerly awaiting to meet the barrel of my M18 Hellcats. No problem. I'll blow you to bits. So he's going to finish that move, and we'll be back with a new die. Ah, nice one. More Imperial dice. More. What do you want to do? I want to shoot with my uh, sniper team yeah. on that other sniper team. That'll be his targeting my sniper. Or he's rather he's targeting Mr. Fogelman. Don't do it. Uh, oh, uh, uh, no, that's not Mr. Mike. That no, Mr. Mike is the other. Oh, I, we, let's do it like this. You want to shoot that instead? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So patron. the other sniper team. <laughs> yeah, patron against patron. Yep. So Mr. Mike Golf versus Mr. Michael Fogelman. Yeah. Uh, so you are a regular. Yeah. That uh, gives you a to-hit basis of three. Yeah. You're a sniper. That puts you down to two. two. Then you have long range. Long range. That is back to... Th and it's a small team, which brings it up to four. four. So 50% to hit. 50% to hit. Oh, hit. it's a hit. Uh, pretty much snipers ignore cover. Otherwise, I would have gotten that. But he's still hit on a five. Uh, now, uh, my guy is a regular, so you kill on a four. A four coming up. No. That's a three, but he applies a pin. Okay. Oh, uh, all the um, Aussie forces uh, are down until given an order. Down. They're down yes. with so, it. So, uh, an additional one to hit. Although down is not affected oh. by the sniper. So, the sniper just ignores it. So, that was it. We'll be back. And returning fire, we're not going to take pins or casualties without well, retaliating. Open fire, Mr. Fogelman. So within six of Mr. Stevens. Yeah. So he grants a bonus of, uh, I think it's four. I need to double check that, but he grants a bonus enough so they take a test on a ten. So my first dice roll, dice roll with dice that aren't mine. Let's so see the, the ones now. Ten or less. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh four it's a ten. So it works. They pass the test, <laughs> which means we remove the pin. Yeah. And he will be shooting at the sniper team that is not shot yet. You see, I don't kill patrons, unlike you and Sign. <laughs> so I hit on a three by six, same as you. I hit yeah. on a two because I'm a sniper. Back up to three for long range and four for small team. Four for small team. So four plus to hit. Oh, it's a. It's a five. It's a five, and you are a regular. I'm a so regular. So I kill on a four. Yeah. Oh! That's it. Kaboom! And if I'm not mistaken, the sniper uh, does exceptional damage. That means yeah. that if it's a team, it's removed in its hole as a casualty. I basically kill your sniper. Oh, no. We'll double check that and be back if it's... Well, we'll be back regardless, but we'll be back with correction if that's not correct. But your sniper is probably gone. I hope not. So, exceptional damage from the sniper. Killing his sniper team because I hit and I killed. I got a 6, so if I needed to roll more, I'd still roll another 6. No, and no, no. And he Let's see. Let's see. It's close. Oh, it's a 4. It's close enough. No, it was <laughs> a 6, so... He's dead regardless because of yes. exceptional damage roll. So, snipers killing other um, uh, support teams. Uh, like snipers, meter machine guns, light machine guns, and such. Works awesome. Uh, I got another die, and I'm gonna use my uh, mortar, my inexperienced mortar, to open fire. Open fire. At his meter machine gun over here. My medium machine gun. Try putting the camera down here so see if you can get a uh, line of sight from my guy. So, yeah, that's within range. Uh, so, I need a six to hit because of ranging in. Yeah. So let's see how that works out with the new die. There's signs, by the way. Oh, one. That's a one. So who freaking who? Uh, good dice. Is next turn. Me. Next turn. Hitting on a five if they don't move. And another German. Oh no! Wait. This is the Japanese theater. Oh. Okay. Japanese die. 
Yeah. And what are you doing? I'm going to use my howitzer. Your type... Some, 97? Type 92? Type something. Type type. It's a type of a kind. <laughs> uh, what are you going to shoot at? I'm going to fire at that evil, evil... <laughs> yeah, you're uh, going to shoot... Sniper team. You're going to shoot Mr. Fogelman? Oh yeah. Sorry. Yes. So Joachim has gotten a taste of how a sniper works, and now he rightly They're fears them. Evil. Evil. They're bad. Yes. So uh, as my mortar, you need a six to start six. ranging in. If you, unless you want to shoot directly, if you shoot directly, it's a three, uh, four for long range, five for small team, uh, six for light cover. So hitting, mm -hmm. it's better to indirect. hit on a six indirect and then five next turn. Yeah, indirect. Yes. Come on, sixes. It's a two. It's a two. So the voodoo no. is not strong in this one. Ah. You guys asked if he would be smiling as much as me and no. and, and the other oh. guys. And yeah, he can't help but smile. So we have to this is like the fifteenth take we do this since he's he can't wipe his stupid grin off his face. You gotta die, what are you doing? I'm choosing my medium uh machine, machine gun. <laughs> <You're an> idiot. <laughs> hey, what? All right. what? What are you gonna do with it? <laughs> you keep firing at that uh, superstar destroyer. The superstar destroyer, destroyer known as Michael Fugelman. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, that is a basic of, of three. And then and you then have it's long range four, four. and uh, cover, cover five, five and small team sixes. six. So six is to hit with sixes? four shots. Four shots. Yes. If no. you if you add them up, perhaps. Yeah. But I'm not going to let you do that. No. Uh, Japanese die? Yeah. Are you spotting my evil I'm sniper? I'm spotting, I'm spotting uh, this guy. He's spotting for my... Uh, oh, you're actually spotting? Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. So, medium mortar? Medium mortar on your crew inside your okay. house. Yep, yeah, so he's shooting my green unit. Which, if he pins, they will take a lot of pins from being hit and being a mortar. And if they fail... Uh, a test they can be dead in one round. Yes, and that's a good thing. So let's see how you do. You need a six to hit, shooting indirectly, ranging in. Oh, it's a six! Oh, craps. Uh, how many <laughs> D6s is that? Look at the chart, find the medium mortar. Medium. Mortar. Of course, I know what it is, but I have to get him to learn. Hey, combine. Medium, medium, medium. There. Uh, D6. D6. Roll a D6 for the number of hits. Yeah. Two, two hits. Uh, and you have a penetration value. It'll say pen or HE or H -E. just HE. Yeah. Uh, so if you look at the chart on the next sheet, there you go. And you look at the top. Top. This is fun. Pen of plus one. Uh, one, yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, what? We'll be right back after these messages. <laughs> Teaching him the basics and interrupting his Norwegian speaking, he has now learned that an HE of D6 gives a plus two uh, penetration value. And since these guys are uh, inexperienced, they die on three, uh, so okay. that's down to one, but one is failed, so they you kill on a two plus, and you have two possible hits. So that's two dead, two dead, and you give D2 pins. D two pins. So that's one pin. Uh, now comes the important part. Yes. I need to roll a die. Since I chose that they were green, on a uh, one, they stay, well, very scared and inexperienced for the rest of the game. Yes. They take an additional D6 uh, pins and go down. And if they haven't used use the die, which they haven't, uh, we have to, with it. I'm down with it. So, let's see. I want a 5 or a 6. You want a 1. You want a 1. Oh, it's a 2. That means that they remain inexperienced for the rest of the game. Yeah. Uh, and they are only stuck with that one pin that you gave them. But two guys dead. Yes. Yes, it's me again. <laughs> I was waiting for you to talk. Oh, you have to Gonna have to, I have to let you take the initiative. Yeah, of course. Get into the Voodoo Magic Tabletop oh. Action Groove. So, running. Yep. These guys, we're run. moving up yes, to run. the river. Over the river. So I'm gonna just say that I'm gonna shoot them uh, when they finish their move. So Joachim's gonna run up and place his models, and after that I'm gonna 
do my ambush because he gets slight cover regardless of what I do. And J has finished his move. Uh, and as I said, I'm doing my ambush with my medium machine gun, uh, turning it to fire. Uh, he, we measured, and he is like 18.1 inch out, so that's uh, long range. So we're hitting on a 3 basic, long range 4, uh, and soft cover 5. So 4 dies, hitting on a 5. So it's a 6, so we got one hit and a pin. The pin really doesn't matter because they're Japanese crap. Uh, and they won't charge me. Uh, killing on a 4, since they are regular. And that's a 5, so that's one guy dead. Yoink. Hey, more, yeah. yeah, more running. Yep, I hey, assume these guys. Yeah, I don't have any more ambushes to reveal, so I'm just gonna have to wait for him to do his thing. Oh, we forgot to put a pin on the inexperienced unit, so we'll put a one there. So he's just running up to the river, and that's his move. That's the end of the run move, leading to another. Imperial Japanese die, and I'm guessing more running action. Yes, these guys, they are not rallying, they are running. Running, rallying. I tried to convince him, uh, Joachim, to uh, play the Imperial Japanese army because he really likes Japanese culture and way of life and manga and probably yes. some other Japanese cartoons. Uh, and I thought the army would suit him well due to crazy people charging over a field and slaughtering everything. But for some reason he went with Germans. Might be my second army though, so, but I don't know. Now we're looking at Joachim with Germans uh, at Tabletop Battle, uh, Anders with Germans from Tabletop Battle, and Svein with, well, Germans and everything else. And I'm stuck being the lone, really, alliance player. But then again, I have the dice god, so I'm pretty sure I'm winning. You're the evil guy. <laughs> I'm gonna win regardless. I'm You're not the evil. evil. Guy. Yeah, you are. Dude, you have tentacle monsters in the Japanese culture. That's They're evil. just trying to liberate you. No. <laughs> Continue that. Maybe. Okay. I'm gonna do some action. Action. What kind so of action? These guys are going to advance. Advance to open fire. So, moving. Which is Japanese for fire. <laughs> Ta da! And he ha. Why? Dude, PG 13. It's like playing with Svein. There are children watching this. Fire? Ute. Oh, I thought you said something else. No. Ute. I thought you said the, the ugly word. No, that's not it. That's not a word. So, nine guys advancing up, all of them ending up within. Super short range. Super. Uh, they will advance and open fire. So we have fire. a light machine gun. That's three shots. And then we have the light machine gun loader. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten shots. Ten shots. Uh, so let's see. We have two, four, six, eight, ten. Uh, hitting on a basic three. Movement 4, uh, back down to 3 because of super short range. Uh, and now that I'm outside of the forest, I'm touching the river, uh, there's no uh, minus 1 for debris and uh, light color. Yeah. So hitting on 3s. Hitting on 3s. Oh, that's a lot of 2s. That's a good roll. <laughs> I like that you're using that. Killing on 4s. Okay. That's better. That's three done. Three dead. Possibly. No. So no. three three guys done three and dead. a pin marker. And that, a pin. That works for me. Yeah. And more Japanese. Of course he has more die than me, but now or he's no. he's down to twelve because he lost the first die. So what do you want to do? I wanna run my doctor. Doctor? Mr. Oros. First name yeah. Jacinth. I hope we're saying that name right, Doctor. You're gonna have to let us know if we don't. Doctor. I'm voting for Doctor. Yeah, running 12. Just to get the medic near the front lines in case of further casualties. So, a uh, ally die. I go yes. in the I'm gonna try an order test on these guys. The inexperienced who, uh, well, they didn't the fail their green test. 
Uh, they're going to try to open fire on the unit that I've already put a pin on and dun, hopefully dun, kill some dun. more guys. So we'll open fire and a test of... Um, uh, they're basically 8, pin 7, um, back up to oh, 10 because of uh, nearby NCO captain. Yeah. So 10 plus, or ten no plus. wait, 10 minus. <laughs> They fixed it, so we remove that. So opening fire with everyone's within range. So we have a light machine gun. That's three shots, four, five, six, seven shots, hitting on a basic of four because of inexperienced, uh -huh. five because of long range, and six because of light cover. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So six is to hit. Three. So three hits, killing on force because of regular. And that's one dead. One dead. And another pin. Not that the pin matters another because it's pin. just going to be running. I need another pin by the dust. Yep. We're down to this is you got three dice left, I think. You have two HQs and a no. machine yeah, gun. A machine gun, HQ, HQ. Yeah, so you've got three dice left, this including this one. This one. Yep. Doing a what now? A run. A run. And Shopping. That's pretty much it. We'll be back with new die. You can say something. I forgot what I was. What, yeah. I forgot <laughs> what, what I was going to say. The inexperienced unit over here. <laughs> over there. It's going to open fire without taking a test, shooting at the same target. Same target. So everything is within range. Nothing within short. So we're still looking at uh, sixes to hit. Yeah. But we now have um, fewer shots because of it's a building. So we got, and I only got two windows. So we got three shots from uh, our light machine gun, four shots with our guy in the window, and five, six. Six shots hitting on a six. No hits. That's, no. That's a good hit. Ah. Oh, there we go, casually. So no hits. Nice. nice. I like your new rolling skills. Screw you. And I know what to do. Like you do. I have a die. I'm gonna move my medium, no, my light mortar team up, and they are going to try to mortar. Miss. Okay, this is bad because I keep saying I don't kill patrons. They're gonna try to kill Mr. Mike Golf. So uh, opening fire. Uh -huh. uh, light mortar has a range Sorry. of 24, so that's roll then. So I need a six to hit. A six to hit. That's a one. That's so a that's a complete one. miss, but we'll be hitting on a five plus next turn if he yes. doesn't move. Hello. So two dice left for you. Yes. Running another HQ, are we? Yes. How did you know? <laughs> no, it's uh, it's my, my it's my seventh sense. My sixth sense is dice rolling. Yeah. yeah so running and you're done. So, Joachim's last die, which is obviously the uh, medium machine gun. Now he's ranged in on a 5, so you can stay and shoot, or you can move and remove the 5. Then you reset the mortar thing, but then you can't shoot. No. So you want to lay down some hurt? Or I do you want to lay down some run? You want to lay down some hurt? Some, some fire. Some fire. <laughs> okay, so we are looking at a basic of 3, uh, and light cover 4. Uh, because there, this is a short range, we don't have to measure that because we know that it's roughly 12 inches down to the river bank, uh, so that will be an easy short. So, hitting on force that is one hit, killing on force because they are regular. Yes, oh, can you roll another six? Of course, here it comes. No, you suck at calling, <laughs> you suck at calling. All right, so one guy dead and a pen. <laughs> So three magical die left. One will be used on Mr. Tim Chadwick Rattenbury. He will fi go down. See what I did there? Fi go down. Actually, no, I'm not going to put him in harm's way. So he goes down. Uh, I'm going to advance this unit. That's slightly funny. sideways and back. So that they can open fire. On the soon to be charging unit, I would guess. Mm, perhaps. Actually, we'll put. There we go, because that's the medium machine gun loader. 
There we go. And now everyone can draw a line of sight to your guys. So we have machine gun. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten shots. Ten shots. Uh, short range on everything. Uh, so let's see. Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten. Uh, so yeah, uh, three basic, uh, four for movement, five for light cover. So five shots hitting on. No wait, five shots, ten shots hitting on five. Oh, you can roll five. So that's two hits, and killing on fours. One dead. One dead. And another pin. Not that it matters because they will be charging, which is why I'm hopefully whittling them down to enough people to kill. Last, my veterans, which will be advancing here, so that they are in, still in the forest, but able to shoot out. So I'll just place them slightly ramshackling around here. I see something moving in that. Yeah, open fire forest. in that general direction. There we go. Do you and need to take a spot test? No. They will be shooting everything they have. Let's see, at that'll be three, long range four, light cover five. Yeah, they will be shooting everything they have at your medium machine gun. Medium machine gun. So that is long range for everything. So mm -hmm. that is a, a, medium, a small machine gun, that is three shots. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Do you count the uh, forest thingy yes. bushes? So we're looking at a basic of three uh, for veterans, four for movement, five uh, for long range, and six because of light cover. So six is to hit. Six is to hit. Oh! Oh my god. You see how that works? And forced to kill because they are regular. And only one guy dead. No! Good That's rolling. not enough! Good rolling! And that was it for round number one. We'll be back with round two. And I will be doing some charging now, so let's turn on the mini cam. In the round two. Yes. So, uh, I will attempt to charge with my regular unit since I'm in base contact with the. Uh, the river, I can move and charge six inches. So hopefully that will go okay. So a run order. They have a leadership value of nine, minus one pin is eight. So eight or less to do a charge. That's seven, so I'm passing. And I'm just gonna move them and we'll be right back after that. And since he doesn't get any defensive fire because, well, we know I was in Within six, super short, last turn, since I shot yes. at him. Yes. Uh, he doesn't get to shoot at me. Uh, no. So I will be hitting him with ten attacks. Ten attacks. And the reason why I'm doing that, even though I only have eight, because I have the national characteristics of tough as boots. So for every three man participating in close combat, I get one additional attack. So ten hits, two, four, six, eight, ten. Killing on a four, because you are a veteran. Oh, and your pin is removed. Oh, yes. Just remove when you get into close combat. Okay. That sucks. So that's only three dead. Possibly an NCO or something else. Nope. So three guys dead. Three. Let's just Pick three random dudes. Remove that's these fine. guys. Uh, and then Joachim gets to hit back with whatever's remaining. Uh, yes. So that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dice. Eight. There you go, eight dice. Thank you. Also killing on fours. And if he rolls more, uh, if he kills four or more, he wins the combat and my unit is dead. Oh my, <laughs> no, you ass. I hate you. So that's <laughs> four hits. The unit is gone. It's gone. Joachim wins close combat. Mwah, mwah, mwah. An Imperial. Dumbass, die! Yes. Stupid freak, kill my unit. What do you want to do? I want to move these guys. Move or advance, or uh, uh, run or advance. If I'm level of fire. 
you want to shoot. All right. So you want what? Where do you want to go? I want to advance and shoot. Okay. So yes. you have to take an order test because you're not Thank running or charging you. or running or advancing. Oh, wait, run here, Charlie. What am I saying? <laughs> All right, so uh, you're at a basic nine because of regular. Yeah. Minus two is seven, and you have a first lieutenant, which brings you up to nine again. Oh, yeah. So testing on nine to be able to move. That is good. So you're good. down to one pin. Yes. So where do you want to move these guys? All right, so six guys. inches and slightly that way. And we'll be back after that. Concluded his movements and yes. we've measured and there's 11 guys or 11 shots that's uh, <laughs> able to trace the line of sight to these guys. The furthest back is the guys and they're not allowed because they can't draw line of sight. Uh, he is heading on a 3 basic because of regular, a uh, 4 for yes. movement, yeah. 5 because of pin and 6 because I'm in cover. Yeah. And then back down to five because of super short range. So hitting on five on eleven shots. One, um, two, three, four hits. Four hits. Yes, and killing on fives because these guys are veterans. Ooh, Ooh two dead. Two. Possibly an NCO. No, but two guys dead and one pen. I need to kill him. He's charging. Oh wait, I'm charging and dying. They are going to repeat, fire, so same as last, we got a light machine gun, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten shots, ten shots. still, well now I'm hitting on one better because I'm not moving, so ten shots hitting on a basic three, and uh, cover, cover four, yeah. that's four, six, eight, ten, hitting on four plus. I am rolling like crap with this die. I like it. And one guy done. And that's not the NCO. Motherfucker! I like your new uh, rolling yeah, skills. Yeah, I don't like my new die. So, no luck with killing anything. Uh, so, I'm gonna try to, well, kill what I managed or shoot with something Can that you actually kill, kill. You kill one guy. Not, that's not enough. I need to kill like 20, well, 30. I'm gonna shoot. Your sniper with my sniper. Your that sniper worked well last round, so let's hope uh, Mr. Fugelman can kill Mr. Uh, Mike Golf. No! So, same as last, I need a 40 hit. 40 hit. That's a miss. That's a miss. Motherfucker! That's a good miss. I hate yes. this guy. Thank you. This was an off camera roll. Where are these dies when I actually need them? Uh, you have a die, Joachim. What do you want to do? Mm -hmm. oh, we want to. There we go. Yeah, you have many options. I do. What do you want to do? What I want to do? Run, walk and shoot, mortar. My mortar. Uh, good, good lesson for you. Uh, mortar something before it moves. Before it moves. Now he is pretty much useless. He didn't move, so you can try to shoot him. Uh, the unit in that. Or you can shoot and hit them on a 2 plus before they move. And they haven't moved, so. Do you want to go there? Yeah. All right. There. Yep. So he's shooting with his medium mortar at my unit in the building. He hit last turn, so he'll be hitting again on a two plus. So You're grab yourself a. Be there. So grab yourself a die, yeah. and hit on the two plus. A two plus. That's a six, so it's a hit. So D six hits. D sixes. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Killing on anything but a one. Oh, you have dice over there. That's possibly the entire unit. Killing on. And the whole unit is kaboom. Boom, shakalaka. <laughs> you ass. You ass. So you're actually standing a chance against me. Well, thing is, the Japanese have fared fairly okay versus me in our Pacific game, so it's only fair that it continues until yes. the war and the or the tide actually turns. This dies. Uh, that I don't know. That I, it's, it doesn't belong there. They don't have any no. pins. Oh, you want to shoot with the thingy? I want to shoot with that thingy, Bob. On what now? That other thingy, Bob. On that unit, yeah. Yes, that so unit. we're looking at a three basic, four for long range, and five for light cover. Yep, so four shots hitting on fives. You, on the other hand, love these yes. die. So two hits, 
Do we get any kills? Killing on force because of regular status. So that's one guy dead and one pin on my regular infantry. More heretical dice for the Japanese army. Uh, repeat fire. Repeat fire. So hitting on a five on my sniper. Mm. Yeah. This battle can be over very quickly if you keep rolling like you. What the fuck? Oh, this is a happy dance that I don't like. Uh, so you have a uh, that is of H E D three. No, it, G remember this is no. This is a crappy one. You right. Yeah, yeah. D three. Yeah. So you have D three. That is pen of D three. That is a penetration value of one and one pin. Okay, so this guy is regular, killing on a four uh, plus one, killing on three plus on d3 hits. So, how many hits do you get? Three. That's two. <laughs> no, that's two. So, two dice, yes. killing on three plus. And the sniper team is dead. Yeah. This is not going my way. Sorry. Sorry, Mr. Michael Fogelman. Uh, new What's guy. Personal? Yeah, a new guy killed you. This used to be the spot occupied by Mr. Michael Fogelman. Hmm. It's now occupied by blood, gore, and a sniper rifle that no one is left to well know how to use. I'm gonna shoot with my uh, light mortar. He hits on a five on your sniper. On my sniper. Oh, it's a hit. It's a hit. Light mortar that is stand still. Light mortar. That is H E D three hits. So that's three hits with a plus one penetration. That's so funny. killing on uh, four basic three plus. No. And uh, your sniper is gone. Sorry, Mike. Sorry, Mike. As you said, nothing personal. Nothing personal. Michael. Sorry. I killed the unit. Hmm. Things are going south fast, but we said it would be bloody. Sorry, Mike. I was just hoping for it to, to be bloody on, bloodier on the other side. My greenies are going to open fire In the on this unit. And I can see 7 out of 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 guys. So only light cover for you. Yes. Uh, so that is uh, 6 shots because of a light machine gun and dudes in windows. Two, four, six. Hitting on a basic of uh, four because of inexperienced. Yeah. Uh, let's see of the range. Uh, that's inside twelve. So it's four basic, five for cover. So six shots hitting on fives. A few of those ones. Starting to get back into it, I hope. No. Two hits, killing on fours. So one dead and another pen. Hmm. So another pin on these guys, I have another die, I'm going to put my uh, medium machine gun in ambush once again. And that's it. So more uh, Australian British die. Uh, fire order for my mortar. For your mortar team. Uh, repeat fire, same target, hitting same on a 5 plus. Time. So that's a medium mortar, that is a d6, if I'm not mistaken, uh, d6 hits. So let's see how many we get, I need more than one. One. I saw the one. That's four hits, uh, plus two penetration, so I'm killing you on twos. You have a three-man team over there. It's dead. Sweet! Hmm. Imperial Japanese die, what do you want to do? I want to advance if I can find it. There it is. Okay, so. Advance, advance over the river and fire at your. Where is your HQ? Didn't you have an HQ model over here? I did. Did you remove him? No, I haven't removed him. Have you removed him? No. Nope. You're picking casualties left and right. So, there's one. one. Yeah, we'll be, uh, we'll be right back. After some logistics, he's magically back. There he's is. removed this casualty for this one unit, but. Uh, he decided to whip his guys into form. Uh, he killed one of them and came back better and stronger. Anywho, uh, leadership test, or wait, morale test of 9 minus 2 is 7. Plus 2 for first lieutenant is back to mm -hmm. so 9 or less. That is fixed, so he gets to flip it back to 1 pin, advance 6 inches, and open fire. 
will be at back after he completes that move. The move completes and he's within super short range. So the math for hitting is you are a regular, that is three. Uh, movement. Uh, plus one. No, minus zero, plus one. It's which four. brings it up to four. And light cover. Yeah, so uh, five. And minus one for super short range. Back down to four. So four on, what was Matt's? Seven shots. Three, four, five, six, seven shots. Hitting on four plus. Ah! One miss. Mother fricker! It's a new dice god in crate. I've, I've played games with this man, boy, thing, for close to 14 years. This is probably close to the best I've ever seen him roll. Killing on force. Oh, that's better. He's back. <laughs> so, one guy dead. More Japanese die. And this comes in the form of a running order? Or... Fire! Fire order. On Fire. Fire, fire, fire. Okay, so we are looking at a uh, three, a basic. Well, you have the leadership test first. Yes, Le leadership. No, that's wrong, Army. Leadership. Leadership. Okay. Who eight? That is what you need. You are regular at nine minus one pin is eight, so you remove the pin. Lucky you. All right. Uh, can you measure the range, please? We are looking at three yes. basic. Uh, which unit are you shooting? I'm shooting uh, the mortar. Yes, yeah. all right. Mortar team. Uh, so over right. sixteen. Over yeah, over eighteen. Yeah, over eighteen. All right. Sorry. So we're looking at three basic, uh, long range, four, light cover, five, small team six. So four shots hitting on a six. Come on. Sir. No. Yes. 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 No. And killing on a four. It's a four, so one guy dead. That leads me to take a test. Crap. Oh, take a test. <laughs> <laughs> Which I pass. I lost a guy, and I gain a permanent pin. Uh, uh, just like I've lost an NCO. So they have a minus one to morale value, so now they have a leadership of eight. Um, the pin is applied before the morale test is taken, so yes. they mm, will take the test after they receive the pin, but I rolled an 8, okay. so they pass regardless. Yes. But you have another die. I do. What do you want to do? I want to move my, my boss. Which one? That one. That one. That, so that you just want to move him up to the river? Yeah. Something uh, that moves. Let's see. And did he have a rifle? Mm, he should have. Yeah, let's check the armor list on that one. Yeah. Because yeah, if he yeah. has a rifle, uh, if you can draw a line of sight down to this building and have range, you can take a pot shot. So find your measuring tape thingy and measure up 24. Yeah. Every shot counts in bolt action, people. Uh, no, that's mm. way above 24. That's 24. So in advance to get in base contact with the river, and that's it. Yep. After psycho swimming, as he calls it. I'm going to do my HQ unit. He's going to uh, open fire. Who's controlling your HQ unit? Uh, that'll be Mr. Uh, Tim Chadwick Stevens Tim. from Down Under. So, appropriately, an Australian is commanding the Australian commander. So, I'm going to draw a line of sight here. Do we agree that that's outside of the building? That's okay. So, it doesn't have to move, but that's uh, long range. Yep. So we're looking at an inexperienced uh, captain, so that is a basic of four, long range, yeah. five. Five. That's a miss. Keep thinking. I'm gonna do a leadership test. I draw my last die. Leadership test uh, of nine. Whew. Pass. Pass. They're veterans. Yeah, guys in the forest. So they're gonna move. Uh, let's see, the furthest back is guy, or the guy that matters. Let's move six inches up here. And then let's just follow with the rest of the guys. Six. Six. And then will be the loader down here. And the last guy. Here. And he can't shoot because he can't see out. Yeah. 
So we have machine gun and one, two, three, four guys are able to shoot. That's three, that's seven shots yeah. at this unit. Uh, none of them are within super short. Uh, so that's basic of three, basic three. Four, four, and light cover five. Five, five shots. No, wait, <laughs> again, <laughs> hitting on fives on seven shots. Seven shots. I need to whittle him down. No! <laughs> Good rolling! Oh, no! He's almost crying. <laughs> oh. We'll be back with the rest of Joachim's die. Do the rest of Joachim's die on the run. Yes. He has uh, oh, three, four, four units. What do you want to do? I want to advance this over or run. Or... Yeah, they want to run. Yeah. So just let's indicate where they end up. And the reason why he's not running 12 is because it's uh, of difficult terrain, so we can only run 6. So that's where he gets to. Uh, you sure you don't want to just advance and shoot? Mm. You advance but and shoot. You can lay down some fire down yeah. in this direction. Thank you for that. I'll do that. So advance 6 Seven inches. Six. And we'll be well back after that since we decided to shoot. So that's an advance, yeah. and he's going to be shooting at my machine gun team, and I'm going to ambush his advancing team. Yeah. Uh, so a fire order is given, and that is four die, and I'm a regular, so I'm hitting on a three. Yes. Uh, could you measure the distance between us, please? I can. Is uh, it 18 uh, or less? 18. 18? Uh, to the front, to the front nearest, <laughs> backers guys, as Swain would say. Front guy. All right. So we're at three plus yeah. uh, and debris or light cover uh, four plus. So four plus on four shots. Whew. One hit, one dead. Mm. So that's uh, one pin and one removal of nope. one nope. guy. Nope. Nope. Are you within six of the medic? Uh, now, now you finally remember. Yes. He All right. Is. So you get to roll a die. So Mr. Doctor. On Good a job. six plus, the doctor will operate. Oh, give me a break. <laughs> you freak show. Well, you get a pin, and that affects your shooting, dumbass. All right, so how many shots are we looking at? We're looking at three, loader, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen shots hitting on a... Uh, that was just eighteen to you, to you, so that means that your light machine gun is out of range. You're hitting on a three basic, four for pin, five for movement, and six for light cover. So six on 13 shots. So going by his math, this will probably be 12 sixes. It's two sixes, killing on fours. Oh, 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 possible exceptional damage. No, and the medium machine gun bites the dust and dies. You, what the hell? Spot previously occupied by the now dead <laughs> Mr. Ferrantes. And sorry. Joachim is really sorry for treating you this way in his first game. I'm gonna throw the camera in your face. What do you wanna do? I wanna run this guy's. Yep. That way? Yep. Mm. So, really putting the pressure on the middle here. And he's on the road. There's no debris on the road, on the road itself. So, he can run 12. So the front guy gets to here and we'll be back with his next die. After completing all his moves, well, he only had this unit to, uh, unit left to run and the medic and HQ um, uh, get right behind them, so just falling. So putting pressure on the middle here. Yes. And um, just for funsies, we're now changing it up just to see if the dice actually have something to say. So <laughs> from now on, we're rolling my own die to see if it actually helps. Uh, it, it, might be too, it might be too late though. Yes, I hope so. First die, oh, new die, or old die, my die. I don't want to die. These guys, <laughs> they will attempt a charge. Yeah. Uh, so leadership test on a nine minus two is seven. Yes. Let's roll one die first and we'll see what happens. Okay. Oh, a four and a six. Ah, oh, seven. Mm -hmm. Yes, they do oh, it. No. <laughs> uh, and I am within super short, so you don't get to react. 
Yeah. So the pins go away from both units. And VOG! <laughs> That's a wrong game. Very wrong game. Though, apparently, there's supposed to be orcs in every fantasy or science fiction universe. But this we, is don't, we don't know if this universe is size of fire or fantasy. But to us, it isn't. It, to us, it's reality. Yes. But I, as the Mythbuster said, I take your reality and I replace it with my own. So that's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven guys seven hitting, uh, plus the British special rule, uh, plus. British? British Australian rule. <laughs> uh, toughest boots. So yes. for every three men hitting in close combat, I get another attack. So that was seven, plus two additional attacks. Plus so that's two. nine. That's nine. And I will hopefully now get more than three hits. I'm killing you on. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no. Hmm? Not these white die. <laughs> Roll these. There we go. You My know, die. You know that all those dices would have been sixes, right? Yeah, I just put them down. Um. Alright, so killing on force. <clears throat> um, <laughs> your unit's gone. Dude, you <laughs> stupid dices. <laughs> One, two, you three, said four, you five. wouldn't play with those. No, I said I'd try playing with other no. die. This was halfway Swain's idea, just to see if... But it was a good idea. Alright, I'll go back to using the other die next turn. Thank you. If we were actually playing next turn. So, uh, his unit is wiped out, we remove a die, and I consolidate these six inches. Oh, sorry. Which is one. <laughs> a <laughs> That's a good one. Inch. And after that, we'll be back with a new die. So after the loss of a vital unit, uh, yeah, yep, these guys, they're going to go down to that spot. So and uh, you're you're, you're advancing. Advancing. Cool. So that's six inches. Six inches. Yes. Basically, you want to shoot in the window. Yes. Yes. In the window. In. in oh, <laughs> he's part of the gang now. In your end, though. Yeah. So just uh, we'll be back after he's done moving. So after movement, we are looking at 11 shots at super short range through yes. hardcover. Uh, so basic for uh, regular is uh, three and movement plus one for uh, four and hardcover five and six. six. Yes, six. Uh, you yeah, get you get, get you get plus two bonus uh, for hardcover yeah. and super short range brings it back down to five. yes. So 11 shots, hitting on a 5, that is 1, 2, 3 hits, and then you have 2 shots outside of super short, hitting on 6s. So you got 3 hits, uh, killing on 3s. Uh, so one guy dead, possibly an NCO. Nope, and I need to roll a die to see what happens with this unit. So five, so they become regular. Right. Uh, that means that they get uh, leadership nine or morale nine, and they get increased to a basic a hit of three plus. Yes. And we'll be right back. So I'm gonna try to move my light mortar. Yeah. He has a permanent uh, minus on morale, but he manages on an eight. Uh, so he's gonna move and stand right here. Standing uh, firmly in their path so that they can't charge these guys. And then he's going to mortar uh, that machine gun. That machine gun. So hitting on a six. That's a two. Not a six. Wrong number. So five next turn. So thinking pose. What do you want to do? I'm going to choose my. Uh, Medi type. medium mortar. Yeah, that yeah. is the medium mortar, yeah, medium and mortar. that is the time 90 something. Type 90 something. Yeah, medium mortar is firing on your mortar. No, so yes. yeah, he's a spotter over here. He's spotting my team over here. Yes. Uh, indirectly hitting on a six. six. And the way you're rolling, that will be a six. Yep. Hitting on a five next turn. So let's take an order test on my veterans, or more correctly, Joe Medicine Pro. Uh, veterans, uh, so 10 basic, minus 1 is 9. Fixed. 
and they will perform a slight advance or tactical retreat in this case so that they are out of line of sight of his Japs this is making me want to watch the Pacific again I still have one unit that's Japanese that can watch you so you know that I'm yeah, I'm side. shooting at them I want to move from these guys, these are nuts so I'm shooting at you yes. all of them are within, but long range Yeah. Uh, I am hitting you on a basic 3 movement 4, long range 5 light cover 6 yes. so that's 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 shots 3, eight shots. 6 and this is where we will find out if my dies are working, but because usually when I need sixes, I for some reason roll them. So sixes, no six. So you see, my <laughs> dice is it's not the dice, you morons. I worked it into you your head. Ryan, you both idiots. So no go on that front. Uh, I'll activate my uh, HQ. HQ. He will uh, Tag an eye. open fire. Uh, that's above six. So he's standing still. It's a basic three. Uh, light cover four. Yeah. Four plus to hit. Four plus to hit. Two. <laughs> Nothing's working today. Mm -hmm. The dice gods have left me in total. That's good. No. Yes. Ta -da! Japanese die. Yes. Doing what? Uh, doing this guys. The uh, type something mortar? No, yeah. wait, howitzer. Howitzer. Baby howitzer shooting at. This guy. Directly? Oh, no, wait, you can't do that. You have an NCO in the way. So shooting indirectly. Indirectly. Yes, so that's a six to hit. Yes. That's a three, so miss, but a five next turn. Yeet. And another Japanese die, which will be used for this guy. an advance. Alright, so oh. a leadership test, since yes. they have a pin, uh, making the test on, uh, well, you've got two HQ scores. Uh, yeah. Basic 9 minus 1 is 8, plus 2 from the HQ is... Yeah. 8. 8 Nine. plus 2 is not 8. Mm -hmm. It's 10. Yes. Do I have 10? Yes. So I get... Oh. You get more than you actually have. Is it cum cumulative? Yes, or it's cumulative. Cumulative. Yes. Cumulative. So, uh, leadership test on 10 or less. Two bar. Oh. Crap. So the pin is removed. And where do you want to go? I want to go around the corner or around the right. forest. You, right, well, you're shooting Fire. at these guys? Oh, yes. Right. We'll be back after that move. So movement is done. And let's see about the super short stuff. That is... Six... I'll let you have the light machine gun in on that one. Thank you. So we're talking 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Uh, 10 shots on super short and 3 shots that's not super short. And you are hitting me on a basic 3, movement 4, super short back down in 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 hits and 3 shots hitting on a 4. Snap! So, killing on force. Yes. Bye bye, units. One, two, three, four, five, six. Third unit is wiped out. Damn it! Ta -da. So, how do you feel? I feel like I have a Japanese knife somewhere with some don't shine. I'm gonna try to activate my now regular units that regular. were upgraded uh, due to the green rule. Yeah. Uh, so a leadership test of 9 minus 1 pin is 8. That is a 7, so that's passed. It's passed. They are going to open fire at the jabs right in front of them. Yeah. And you are within 1 inch, uh, so no cover for you. But I'm in the bush. Yes, but you're within 1 inch. And as mm -hmm. per the scenario rules, you don't get cover. But these guys are outside of 1 inch, so you get cover against them. Okay. So we have the light machine gun and one rifle hitting on a basic of three. Minus one for super short. Two. Yeah. And two shots hitting on a uh, basic of three. Uh, shrubbery, four. Back down to three for super short. So hitting on twos. That's three hits. Hitting on threes. That's one. So four hits in total. 
voice, yeah. And killing on force. And so, two guys dead. Not nice. enough. Hi. Yeah. What do you want to do? I want pick these guys. Mm. They mm. are going to find you at the Why are you stuff. singing? Yes, I want to. I've been working all day. At least so. sing Japanese if you're working on it. Me. Okay, that's that's <laughs> that's perfectly okay. We don't need to hear it. So, uh, that thing is shooting at what, uh, yeah, the veterans? Yeah. Yep. Uh, so we're looking at, we know it's long range because I was shooting at long range and it was over 18. Uh, basic of 3, long range 4, uh, and light cover 5. 4 shots hitting on a 5. That's one hit. Killing on a 5 because of veteran status. And that's one guy dead. <laughs> Another one bites Sorry guys, this. you're dead. That's a pen, and we'll be right back. So the reason why we were filming this ugly mug is because I drew my last die, which I will use on my mortar team, and they will fire at these guys. These guys are too close. Uh, so I need a six on an indirect shot. That's a four, so it's a miss. Yeah. And what do you want to do with your four remaining die? My die. What do you got left? You have this. Yeah, you got this unit. Yeah, you have yeah. HQ medic and um, HQ. Doctor. Yeah, Doctor Jessen. Doctor. Uh, I want to move. Uh, I can do that unit first. Yep. So. so what do you want to do with them? Uh, fire. No, really? No fire. Is it advanced? It's run. It's run. You want to? Uh, I want to charge. You, <laughs> you want to overkill. I want. All right. So <laughs> basically, you get in base contact. You yeah. have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven die. You kill on a four. Just roll a couple. I don't think he gets to strike back. Yeah, he died. Uh, D six <laughs> consolidation. Could be unlucky. D six consolidation is whopping one inch from that point. Uh, we'll be back after he's done that. One inch move brought you all the way to, well, not very much closer to uh, our veteran units controlled by Joe Crow. Joe Crow. Yeah. Uh, so what do you want to do with your remaining three single models? I want to move that guy over the river. Yep, six inch, that's no problem. Yeah, so that's an advance or run? Advance. advance. Or run. He doesn't get to shoot anything because there's nothing you can see. So just over. Oh, yep. Rainbow. And Doctor. Doctor. Uh, that guy is that one. So he's one to uh, run, I think. But it pushes, so I move my HQ in first. Yep. It's uh, running ish. So that's his, his. The advancing Japanese force. Yeah. Yep. So, you want to shoot with him as well? Yeah. Then it advances. Take a shot down here on yeah, my uh, medium mortar team. So that is uh, movement and long range. Hitting on a three basic movement, four long range, five. Oh, will you stop? Uh, it's a hit, killing on. Uh, these are inexperienced. Yeah, no kills, but a pin. What the hell? Hmm. Oh, yes, medic. Medic. Doctor. The doctor. Doctor, doctor. He is um, just following up. Yep, within six of, well, a lot of units. He has uh, rifle rights. So. Yep. Uh, no, he doesn't have anything. What? At least I don't think so. Let's uh, be right back with that doesn't have anything as per the unit uh, entries that we've been given. Uh, he can charge and kill, but uh, that's pretty much it. We'll be around with what I suspect is the last turn, uh, <laughs> turn four. Again, I get the first die of the round. I have to use these guys because he's going to charge them and I don't get to ret or, uh, retaliate. Re retaliate with the shooting since it's too close. So I'm going to have a fire order on these guys. Uh, so same as last, four shots hitting on two, and two yeah. shots hitting on a three. So that's two hits, mm -hmm. and two shots hitting on three. Ah, what? Four and uh, two. two. So three hits, 
killing on force. That's two dead. One. Yeah. Two guys dead. At least that's two attacks less. There's another die. Yes, I do. What do you want to do with it? I want to activate my the guy that has range in on these guys. Yeah. Oh, more uh, the baby howitzer. Yeah. Baby yes. <laughs> uh, hitting on a five. Hitting on a five. Yes, yes, yes. We're going back to playing 40k, at least there I kick your ass. Yeah, but... Which we incidentally, him and me, we will be playing the first 40k game of Tabletop Battle on film. Uh, in January, we hope. Yes. That's when we have our RVs painted up with 750 points. For those of you who are interested in that. So, uh, D3 hits. I'm gonna slap you. <laughs> I'm really gonna slap you. Killing on 2+. plus. And the unit's gone, and the dice out of the bag. What the hell? <laughs> and Ta yeah, what I do you want to do? One. Yep. Uh, I want to charge these guys. Of course you do. Yep. After being insanely lucky, stealing my mojo and voodoo and everything else, yes. and hitting on a six, rolling a six, and then killing on all three hits. Rat bastard. Alright, so you don't need to take a test because you're Jap. So you basically just get to charge the windows and put your knife, dagger. Is it, is it two per window or, no, or um, just strike the wall? Uh, everyone's, uh, everyone's fighting. Oh. They're just poking their uh, <laughs> ninja swords in the window and stuff. Uh, being that I am in cover, we get to strike at the same time, but you can roll your dice first. And we're looking at two, four, six, eights. So you're killing on fours. Yeah. And pretty much, uh, just to say it before he rolls, if this charge kills or destroys my unit to the uh, length that I lose combat and die, the game is pretty much over because my veteran unit is too far away to stop the rest of his guys from occupying the buildings. So this is pretty much make or break the game. How many do you kill? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. And after being rudely interrupted by battery saying go away and I'm uh, out, I uh, don't, don't exactly know what you missed, but um, he managed to hit on five, six, seven, eight out of ten die? No, oh, eleven die? Eleven die? Uh, and he needs to roll the sixes again to see if he kills uh, a uh, light machine gun or an NCO. So roll the sixes again. If you roll a six, you can choose one of the two. And no sixes. No. So you kill uh, you kill six guys, and I get to retaliate with my nine. So I'll just give the camera over to you. You can fill my moment of glory or other defeats. Moment of failure. And there's nine guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And the British special rule states that units that are regular or veteran has mm -hmm. tough as boots, so one extra attack for every three guy. That's three attacks extra, so I'm attacking like with 11 die. Yeah, but you only roll one. Nine, right? 12 guys. Unless I get a six. So, 12 attacks, I need to kill more than six guys. Killing on fours. Yeah, that's not a problem. Your unit is wiped out. Mm -hmm. Two, four, six, seven, Eight, nine, two, four, six, eight. Yep, the unit is dead. Yeah. Sweet. Uh, and of course, he didn't hit me with ten attacks or eleven attacks. He hit me with eight because he had eight dudes. Yeah. Uh, and they will consolidate after winning, a whopping possible six inches. So they will move away from the windows and yeah, uh, away from wherever he can be shooting at me. Yeah. Uh, and after that, uh, I pull the next die, so I'll just give the camera over to him and we'll be right back. So, there's still hope at the end of the tunnel. These guys will be giving or getting an advance order. Uh, leadership test of 10, minus 1 is 9. No! 11! Ah. They stay put, so they go down. Sometimes the dice works against you. Yeah, rolling high isn't always a benefit. And he has a die. What do you want to do? I want to use these guys to charge that unit. Alright, let's check the range. 
That's the run over, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, you're at four inches, so that's good. So just move the closest guy to the closest guy, and we'll be back after completing the move. So 11 attacks from the Imperial Japanese twats. Uh, killing on fives because I'm a veteran. <laughs> what the hell? Will you look at this? <laughs> it's like I, 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 he's taking my mojo. So that's my, the unit's wiped out uh, to a man. So that's uh, five, six, seven, eight dead of the six possible that could actually die. Yeah. Consolidation. D6. Consolidation. D6. That's a three, and we'll be back with the next die. And he has a die. Yes, I have. Uh, I have one die left, and that's my HQ. My uh, captain will save the day. Hey. Will. Advance or move? Yep. So yeah, basically, you yeah. can't see anything, so you might as well advance. Six inches. But can, can run uh, uh, as he's on the edge? No, you're on. Uh, in the, it's a team weapon, so they can't run 12, regardless, so you're moving six. So six. And that's it. Another die. Yeah, what do you want to do? I want to move my spotter guy. Yeah, so he's activating the mortar unit. Yeah. And the spotter is running, running. whopping six since he's not on the edge. Leave it on the edge. And that's it. And. I got the other one. What do you want to do? I want to move my uh, HQ unit. Yes. Uh, advance, advance. Mm -hmm. I want to try to fire at your HQ unit. At my HQ. So six inches to go that way. Mm -hmm. And. Is it fine? Or do I need to move? No, uh, you can draw line of sight. Yeah. Line of sight, you can see the model, so no hard cover. So it's movement and. Uh, short range, let's see, your basic 3, movement 4, small team 5. One shot hitting on a 5. Captain America will not say they, he hits again. Killing on a 3. And my HQ is dead. Oh, Sorry. That is uh, Mr. Tim Chadwick Stevens, he leaves the game. This has been a patron slaughterhouse. Sorry Tim. Dude, I'm gonna make it my goal to eliminate the last patron. Oh. This is the last patron, right? Yeah, yes. I'm gonna kill him. No, uh, Tor. What do you want to do? I, you took my die, so you can just move the rest of your guys. Oh, okay. Sorry. There's no sorry. I want to. This is bloody serious. This is a bloody game. I wanna move that guy out of out of the way. <laughs> Chicken shit. But where do you want to go? This is Doc Tor. Yep. He's gonna wanna. Uh, but I still want to achieve, try to achieve some kind of victory thing. Try Going six inches run. that way. Yeah, I'll do that. Long or something. Then at least you're within. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be. Are you moving or are you. I'm moving. Yep. At that one. And the doctor um, flag goes with him. Four. And your infantry unit. Infantry unit is also. But I have to get a unit inside. You have to get a unit one, inside so. one of these buildings and me outside of four to achieve a minor victory. And two buildings with me outside of four to achieve a major victory. Okay. So that guy, that unit just run towards that house. Yep. And... Uh, yeah. Or should I perhaps try to go that way? I think I'll try to do that. Where are you going? And when that one got these guys are moving towards those. Move the furthest from this guy. Yeah. Whatever. So this is. And we'll be back. But after moving, he ends up here, and there's nothing for him to shoot at. Yeah. So what do you want to do? And move these guys. Yes. Upwards. Just move them six frontwards. Frontwards. Or forwards. That's Forward. a word. Frontwards. I don't think that's a word. Forwards. And after you move baby howitzer, you only have the cowardly HQ left. Cowardly. Who's, what's he gonna do? He's going to move towards uh, the house. Yep. And uh, when we say he ha needs to have a unit inside a building, a uh, unit is a description of anything having a 
or to die. Of course, a uh, vehicle can get inside buildings. So that's it for round four. Uh, I have one unit left, and the Japanese have overrun my positions. And naturally, he has the first die, since I'm yeah. left with one. Then I'm going to activate these guys. Yep. I'm going to move towards uh, tree, uh, past the forest. And then towards my guys? Yeah, and then fire at your so guys. Move your dude up to my thumb. Do it. I'm going to shove it up his uh, helmets. <laughs> And we'll be back after we complete the move for the rest of the guys. Movement completed, and we've uh, done some measuring. Six shots from within short range, six shots from outside of long range. So the short range will be on a basic of three, a movement of four, and light cover five. Of fives. None. No. And another six shots. Hitting on a six. That he makes. Yes. So one hit and force to kill. Yes. Roll the six again. Yes. Roll the six again. Again? No. So one guy dead and a pen. Yeah. Or jet die. I got next one. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to move my doctor. Where? That guy um, to the uh, yeah, building. So you get him down to the door. Yeah. So he's going to end up here. And, yeah. The doctor is going to the building to operate. Yeah. Trying to desperately survive Yacinth. Jeff die? Yeah. He's going to activate these guys and they're going to go into Alpers. Oh, sneaky oh, cutting off the line. Fine. The dice might end up in your forehead. Might be. So my last die. <clears throat> yes, you're going to activate that. Yes, I am going to unit. Uh, oh, this unit will do what? I'm going to put the. Uh, they're going to advance inside the building. So the machine gun shooting up the hole. Rifle shooting up the hole. Uh, loader. This will be the loader in the back. And one guy shooting over here. Two guys shooting out there. And three guys outside. And do you know why I'm putting more guys inside the building than outside? Yes, so you get the hard cover. Good boy. So we get uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine shots at these guys. Yeah. Uh, super short for the machine gun That's and the other guy in the window. So that's four shots. Yeah. Hitting on a basic of three, movement four, light cover five, super short, back down to four. Yeah. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, hitting on a five. five. Okay, so four, four plus on these guys. That's two hits. And then we have five shots, hitting on five plus. Four hits, killing on four. That's three dead. Yeah. Ooh, and your NCO. Oh. Oh. Wait, no. I'll take your left machine gun. Oh. So in an effort to speed it up, uh, basically Joachim's left with all die. Yeah. He's gonna move into die. cover. Yeah. His That's other fine. HQ is going to run behind the building. Yeah. Uh, let's see, they got a fire order or a advance. Oh, it's there somewhere. Uh, okay, wait. Svein is going to edit this so he wants it correctly. Fire. Uh, and the medium machine gun team will run six inches, just move them ever so slightly. And the reason why they're only running six is because they're, uh, well, it's uh, heavy to drive around a medium machine gun. Uh, then he can start shooting with the, the other stuff because now we can see through the windows again. So spotting for the medium mortar. Hitting on a 6. <laughs> Thank God. And baby howitzer hitting on a 6. Ah! <laughs> Living dangerously. And that's it. We'll be back with decisive round 6. So Jap die of course.
Will it be used on a mortar? A mortar spotter. Yes. So hitting on a five. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Come on. Ow. Hitting on a four next round. And that's it. Uh, no, it's not a mortar, but it's a howitzer. Baby howitzer. howitzer. Yes. Baby howitzer hitting on a five. I'm so glad these guys turned out to be regular. <sighs> hitting on a four next turn. My last die. <laughs> I need to move. First I need to move. Moving six inches. Let's see if I can move outside. No, wait. Yeah. Moving this way. So my guys will end up here. Yeah. Mm, yeah. And we'll be back after I finish moving. Yeah. That's fine. We'll say no zooming. It was zooming. It was just focusing. Oh, okay. Anywho, uh, moving here and opening fire. Everything is in super short. I couldn't charge because I was inside the building and only the guys inside the building were within six. So yeah. we're looking at uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine shots mm -hmm. uh, hitting on uh, uh, nine shots hitting on a basic of three, movement four, uh, light cover five, back down to four because of super short. Uh, and uh, I get two extra die because the guy with the the, head, uh, the machine gun doesn't count. Machine gun doesn't and, count. Uh, so I cheated you last uh, uh, when they sh were shooting with the uh, nine or a lot of shots. Uh, so we got three uh, nine shots basic plus two shots for the British special rule. So uh, hitting on a four. Hitting on a four. One. Slightly above fifty percent. Killing on a four. Only once. So that's three dead. Three dead. And yeah, not the answer, but three dead. Three dead. Ba -ba. Come on, death before dishonor. Yes. Charge. This guy's ah. going to charge. All right. So he disregards this, and we know it's within six. So he just gets to banzai. Yeah. We don't have science uh, characteristic bonsai charge shout. So you have four attacks, uh, killing on force. That's two, which means that two guys are dead and I get to hit back with one, two, three, four, five, six guys. And that means I need to kill three to win. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. Yay, I win combat. <laughs> But you remove two guys. This is really getting hairy. Two guys dead. Yeah. Your unit is... Oh, wait, you have a Japanese special rule. We'll be right back after that. So he's a fanatic. So he... When the Japanese lose combat, just remove casualties and keep on fighting until they're gone. Yeah. Uh, so you now we strike uh, at the same time. Uh, so you get to roll your die. You're killing on a four, as usual. You kill a guy, it's a six, roll it again to see if you kill the machine gun or an NCO. Nope. No. So another guy is dead for my unit, and I get to hit back with six because that was the original count at the start of the round. Six months. And your guy isn't dead. <laughs> <laughs> so I lose combat. Uh, and what happens then? Seriously? What the hell? <laughs> oh. Yeah. This one. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> this isn't freaking possible. All right, the game is over. Uh, Joachim has officially beaten the crap out of me uh, and obliterated. Uh, this is called he tabled me. He removed every British Aussie force on the uh, table. Major victory. He got a major victory because he will easily occupy the two buildings. But wiping out an opponent is um, pretty much a massacre. So, good job on you. you. We'll be right back with summary. Yeah, so I have no idea what happened. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna blame the new guy for, well, taking my mojo, but I've been tabled. Uh, I have no problem admitting it. Uh, I mean, we all know by now that I'm a tournament player, but many of the best games I've ever played I've lost, and this was fun, and it was slightly expected as the Japanese can be stopped, but my dice rolling was horrible. Oh, it was good. And your dice rolling was 
over the edge insane. It, yeah, it, it was know. almost like playing myself. I never rolled that good. Oh, wait. Ever. It was almost like playing with myself. <laughs> that that no. just sounds wrong. All right, pretty much the Japanese charge forward. I couldn't eliminate enough numbers uh, to stop him from charging and killing and me failing my own charges. I charge him expecting to win and he kills me instead. Yeah. And this one lone moronic HQ Guile killed a five-man unit on his own. Kyle's the match. Yeah, man of the match. And the doctor, you live to operate. Yes, Way to doctor. go. Uh, so that was roughly a thousand points of Japs, defeating roughly 800 points of uh, uh, Australian slash British uh, troops. Uh, and this was battle number one in a series of uh, three by uh, Mr. Greenwood. Uh, next battle, I don't know when we'll be filming it, uh, but it will continue the Japanese well land onslaught. Uh, versus uh, islands and territory in the Pacific. Uh, so this has been uh, Joachim and Damon. Upside down. Yep. From Tabletop Battle with his uh, Virgin game. I think you did a good job, guy. And if you're fans of Joachim, or me, I don't need more fans. <laughs> if you like him, go to our uh, Tabletop Battle uh, group on Facebook uh, or go to our webpage uh, www.tabletopbattle.com to check out other battles that we've had. We have a roughly, I think we're up to 90 battles now. Yeah, you have three pages in uh, YouTube. Yep, so he's this guy is taking care of our webpage. That's his new job. Uh, anywho, look us up uh, and thank you for watching the game. <laughs>